Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky thanked Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan for supporting Ukrainian position on the latest provocative decisions of Russia, using flag emojis in place of the names of the two countries. Shortly after Russian forces invaded Ukraine in the early hours of Thursday, the Ukrainian embassy in Ankara was quick to appeal to Turkey. The Russian Federation has started a war against Ukraine. Peaceful Ukrainian cities are being bombed. We call on our strategic partner Turkey and the friendly Turkish people to support us in this difficult time, the embassy tweeted. Ukraine's ambassador to Turkey Vassal Bodner also asked Ankara to prevent Russian ships from passing through the Bosphorus and Dardanelles Straits. The Bosphorus Strait joins the Black Sea and the Marmara Sea and the Dardanelles Strait links the Marmara Sea to the Aegean Sea. Later on Thursday, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan spoke to his Ukrainian counterpart, Volodymyr Zelensky, and condemned Russia's invasion of Ukraine as a heavy blow to regional peace and stability. We reject Russia's military operation, he said in a televised speech after convening an emergency security meeting. On Tuesday also, Turkey's Ministry of Foreign Affairs had been quick to denounce Russia's move to recognize the independence of two breakaway territories in the eastern Ukrainian region of Donbas. Zelensky at the time thanked Erdogan in a tweet for supporting the Ukrainian position on the latest provocative decisions of Russia, using flag emojis in place of the names of the two countries, while the Kremlin said differing views on Ukraine will not be an obstacle to ongoing relations between Turkey and Russia. On Thursday, the Turkish lira took a hit following the news of the Russian attack, dropping from about 13.8 to 14.2 to the United States dollar. Turkey's position as a crucial NATO ally that also maintains an uneasy, complicated relationship with Russia means that Erdogan has to maintain a keen balancing act, one that may prove harmful to the country's geopolitical influence. Turkey's fence-sitting will likely prove successful in mitigating the most damaging consequences from this conflict, but will come at the expense of the more ambitious role it seeks to play as a global power. If neither Turkish diplomacy nor Turkish drones have any impact on the course of the crisis, little is left of the hype surrounding Ankara's new, more assertive foreign policy, Danforth said. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to get more exciting videos.